Hi everyone, David here. Welcome back to the channel. Thanks for coming back for another video or welcome if it's your first one. Um, today I'm going to be looking at a bit of special food from one of the big convenience stores, Family Mart. Um, as you might know, I've, I've done a video about this, the uh, kind of a bunch of big convenience store chains in Japan and Family Mart is one of them. Um, I don't go there that much anymore because there's not really one close to my apartment. Um, 7 is a lot closer so I tend to go there or Lawson. Uh, but I do like Family Mart. Their family chicken is, uh, yeah, particularly delicious. The kind of chicken things. In fact, I actually did a video about that too, uh, trying all the uh, convenience store chickens. Um, but today I'm not talking about chicken. I'm going to uh, look into the Animal Crossing uh, collaboration food event thing that they did uh, in January uh, or and December, December 2023, and into January. Um, I've done a video a bit like this before. Actually, one of my first videos ever on this channel was um, 7-Eleven's uh, Super Mario collaboration food. I've got four things to look at today. So we're gonna get uh, right into that. I'm <laughs> hoping it's not gonna take too long. I always say that with the food videos, but they always seem to get really long. Uh, I'm not gonna eat too much. I've had a kind of a light brunch. Um, so I've, I've got enough space before dinner. Uh, for those people who don't know, Animal Crossing is a game for the uh, Nintendo Switch. Uh, which is it's one of my favorite games. It came out about four years ago almost. That's incredible. Um, that got a lot of people through the COVID uh, lockdown phase because um, it's a very kind of restful, uh, kind of like a second life game where you take control. Uh, in the latest one, you take control of a, an island and you kind of build it up from nothing into like a, a nice community with animal villagers and you can decorate things yourself and uh, you can catch fish and or do whatever you want to do you can you can do it in animal crossing um so to oh, I don't know, to celebrate that i don't really know what they're celebrating but animal crossing is always popular um probably going to be waiting a, a while for a new game but uh never mind um let's get into this so i've got four things today there was one thing i couldn't get from family mart i i went to four family marts today i, I kind of took a wide loop and uh, went to a few different shops I managed to get um, yeah two in the first one, and then one each in the next two, and then I couldn't find the last thing. The thing I couldn't get was a uh, cafe latte. It's kind of like um, pre uh, pre prepared is that word prepared um, cafe latte drink, a chilled one. Um, I couldn't find that anywhere, which is just as well really because I hate coffee. Um, I was going to try it for you, but um, never mind. Destiny smiled down on me today, so I'm going to look at the first one now. Oh, before I say. Like, subscribe, comment, uh, share this channel. That would help me a lot. Don't do all the whole uh, sales talk. Um, here you go. So here's the first one. This is the, what's it called? The uh, Ringo no Danish, so the apple Danish. And as you can see, just about, you can see the little apple, apple shaped uh, Danish inside. What does that say? Uh, oh, uh, what's that? Um, island picked apple Danish. Like I said, uh, you're you're on a on an island in the game. You can see a little bit, bit of a plan. It's going to be filled with cream. It's got a bit of apple, uh, stewed apple down there, and uh, a little chocolate stem as well. So, I'm going to open this right away. I'm not going to eat all of this right now because I'm going to explode. But oh, here we are. There we go. Can you see that very nicely? It's a bit glossy. Sometimes the kind of convenience store bread products are a bit oily. <laughs> um, let's, uh, let's see, you've got a little chocolate stem at the top there. I'm going to move this down a bit so you can see. Oh, move it away. It's such a pain to get this. This is why I'm sitting at the desk today. I thought it would be easy. Oh, we don't have a knife. Okay, I'm just going to bite into it. Let's go for it. Hmm. Mm. Oh, yeah, that's nice. Get the apple right away. You can see, you can just about see inside there's a cream in there and there's a little bit of a apple jam. It's not quite as it is in the in the picture, but hmm. Certainly a nice uh, nice strong apple taste. Okay. Hmm. That is good. Mm. Too big a bite out of it. I'm take this little chocolate stem out as well. Oh, goodness me, that's long. Wow. Ooh. Put it back in the later. Hmm. So it's just a hard piece of um, like milk chocolate. Hmm, okay, that's nice. 
I like how it's all coloured as well. You can see, you can see the layers inside. Hmm, no crisscross pattern. Well, you know what that is supposed to be? Is that like um something people do when they make danishes? Hmm. Okay. Yeah, very nice. Very, very appley, very appealing. Okay, I'm gonna leave scores for all of these. I'm not gonna eat all of this now. I'm gonna leave this for later. Uh, so for the apple danish, I'm gonna give this. Um, that's quite nice. Uh, I'll give that an eight. I like the apple. I like danishes. I like uh, chocolate. What's not to like? Okay. Good. Good start. Very good start. Now, one of these things I want to get kind of on the road from now because I've got this uh, tanuki udon. So if you know Tom Nook here, he's the um, uh, or tanu tanukichi. I think that's his name in Japanese. He's like the, uh, well, tanukis are kind of like, well, I don't think we have them in England. They're like raccoon dog type things. And uh, they're known to be a bit shrewd. So I think he's the he's the shopkeeper uh, on Animal Crossing and he's always trying to re re remortgage your house. Uh, so this is the udon. I think, well, the sanuki, sanuki udon is um, a famous udon from Kagawa Prefecture. Um, I've had that before. Maybe I've got a picture here somewhere. Maybe there's not. Um, very delicious, but tanuki udon, I don't know if that's just a pun or that's going to be sanuki flavour, tanuki flavour, I don't know. I'm going to open this up and I boiled the kettle already, but I need a bit of time to, um, only three minutes for this one. Let's see if they're cute, uh, cute. Apparently there's an um, original seal inside as well, so I'm going to open that in a moment. So there we go, it's got some corn in it, I guess, it's got a bit of seaweed, is that? Got some chopped onions. Okay, and there's the little uh, shop from the, the original shop from the uh, from the game. Okay, let's open this up. Open up halfway. Oh, okay. I've got a little uh, free gift inside. I'll talk, I'll talk about free gifts in a moment. How do I open this without destroying it? Oh no! It's only like a sticker inside. I don't want to. Ah, oh, this little, little notch. Oh, this is this guy. Um, I've got Jack. I, don't, I forgot what his name is in the English version, but he's the uh, very sought after uh, new character. Uh, he's a cat. Self plan. No, oh, self or oh, self branding. That's his um, his favourite word apparently. <laughs> so he's another another animal influencer. Okay, well, I've got my freebie. And uh, as you can see, everything's all dry inside there. We've got a bit of, what is that corn? It doesn't look like corn actually. Is that uh, puff rice or something? I'm not sure. Anyway, let's give this a go. Leave this for three minutes. Oh God, excuse me. Spilled it everywhere. There we go, that's gonna bubble away for a bit. Where are we at? We're on eight minutes already, goodness. Okay, so when we get to about to 11, then I'll, uh, I'll unleash it. Got one of these little wet white things that they give you. Let's see if I can soak up some of that scalding water. Okay, all right, let's get on to it's number two's on this way. So let's, um, let's do a quick one. We've got some little gummy sweets. This is called uh, Kogumi. These are quite famous uh, brands in, in Japan. The Japanese people love gummy sweets. Uh, they call them gumi, just the pronunciation. And we've got a nice uh, winter winter pattern on here. We've got um, Isabel here, or Shizue in Japanese. She's like the uh, mayor's assistant in, in this, well, your assistant in this island. We've got those little tanuki cheese again. And that, another angry looking squirrel, I don't know. Um, Animal Crossing is really famous for its like seasonal stuff. Uh, so things are always changing. Obviously we're in winter at the moment. Wish. So let's try a few of these gummies. So kogumi, so the cop part means like baby or child. So little baby gummies, I guess. Let's see if I can get one of each. Oh, there's five types in here. Let's see if I can get all of them. What have we got? We've got uh, apple, orange, pear, peach, and cherry. Okay. We've got cherry, get one of those. And I think that's a peach, I think that's all of them. There we go. Oh yeah, I'm dropping them as well. Oh my goodness. Needs to be a bit more coordinated. So little tiny gummies. Just a peach one. Hmm. 
Oh, that's good. They're very, very flavorful. Is that a word? Okay, let's try a apple. Hmm. Okay, apple-y, that's good. Try an orange. Are you the type of person who like tries all the flavors together or do you sort them out? Oh, that's nice, the orange one's very, um, a nice little sourness to it. We've got the peach as well. Hmm. Okay, yeah, peach flavor's coming through there. Even though I hadn't quite finished the orange one and the cherry. Hmm. Okay. And, uh, the cherry doesn't have a lot to it, but um, there we go. Some nice kogumi. So let's see if you can find those. Um, I think this season's kind of coming to an end already, this promotion. So um, you can get kogumis all, all year round anyway. You probably could taste the same anyway. Um, yeah, not too bad. They're quite nice. I'll give these a, a seven. Okay, put this on the scoreboard. Put those with the uh, Danish. Okay, three minutes have gone past just about. So I'm going to get these as well, but it'll... Uh, Oh, top six. Oh, they're separated already. I think my uh, udon's almost done. It's steaming away. I think if you... Oh, we'll mess this up a bit now. It makes a change. Actually, the lid has got a character on it too, which I'm going to... I've torn it a bit, but there we go. We've got Shizue as well. She's the, uh, the, the mayor's assistant, like I said before. Okay. What does she like? I don't know, I can't read that bad kanji. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> okay, so I can't tilt this too much. I'm gonna tilt this down a little bit. I don't want to spill it, but uh, those little things that I thought was corners kind of uh, bubble their way to the top. It's looking a bit clear, I don't know. Okay, we've got a bit of uh, seaweed bubbling up to the top. Let's give this a try then. This is going to be too hot for me, is it? Oh, sure. Oh, wow. Is this udon? What's up? Strange. <laughs> Strange for udon, really. It looks like uh, ramen. Hmm. Not sure about this. Try some of these little. Um... What are those things supposed to be? It's sort of a bit oniony. I don't know. They're like little puff rice things. If I can pick one up to show you. Well, of course, I'm saying onion. I've got some actual onion in here too. But hmm. Okay, give, give this another bash. It's quite nice. It's not not too rich. Sometimes the cup noodles can be like have just too much flavour in them. Hmm. That's quite nice. Not particularly strong flavour really, but I'm gentle. I mean Santa Cruz on it's not really particularly strong. Strong flavour anyway. Hmm. It's not meaty or anything. Well, this is probably quite healthy, isn't it? Okay. As you can see, I'm very well uh, well researched as always. Okay, well, I'm going to work on that a bit later too. Um, so for the Tanaki Udon, I'm going to give that a... No. Give that a six. It's not that bad. It's just um, fine. I won't go crazy about it. Um, I've got one more item left. Yeah, approaching the 15 minute mark. Um, we've got this, uh, what's this? Uh, Yuki Furoshima no Mashiro no Roll Cake. Okay, so uh, Snowy Island Perfect White Roll Cake. It's a bit of a mouthful. Mashiro means like totally white. Uh, so, as you can see, uh, this is a winter, winter thing, obviously. Got Shizue again, we've got the little um, snowman that you can make. This is a bit creepy on the Animal Crossing. If you make a snowman, it becomes sentient. <laughs> it can um, accuse you of making it badly. Um, so let's see if I can open this as well. 
put a spoon somewhere. Not sure how else I'm going to eat this. So roll cake's pretty popular in Japan too. Oh, can I get this out? Without smushing it. Oh, that looks very, very pretty, isn't it? Look at that. Okay, well maybe I can just eat it without anything. It's very fluffy as well. I thought the sponge is... Let me move this up again. Excuse me. Okay. So soon after the udon, that's a bit uh, hard, but... Mmm. Mmm. There's not much to it. I mean, it's just, um... Just like whipped cream, really, but, uh... That sponge is so soft. It could easily get a bit sort of soggy and horrible, but it's, um, it's very nice. Hmm. Good. Yeah, like I said, roll cake is pretty popular in Japan. You, you can find it in the convenience store all year round as well. We've got some like really expensive ones too. This kind of feels like some, this cake is sort of light enough. It's very, I don't know if you can see very well, but this cake is so soft. It feels like one of the kind of expensive cakes. A bit like the Christmas cake we get here. They're like the, the short cake. Mm. That's good. I've got cream on my face. It's got a big zip here as well. Mm. Okay, that's good. Again, very light, easy to eat. Not too sickly. I, I was wondering if, if like this Danish and this um, roll cake is going to be a bit too sweet. Very nice, I like that. Uh, what did I, I gave the Danish an 8, didn't I? I'll give this a 7, I think, as well. So the uh, Snowy Island beautiful white roll cake. I'll give that a 7. It's, Nothing too exciting, but it's, uh, yeah, job job well done. Okay, I think that's all four of my things. I did get a few extra little bits and bobs. I think they were just kind of clearing out stock, really, because we're almost at the end of the season. I got this kind of sticker sticker sheet. So we've got the, um, like, you can get different forms. There was the summer one. I got the winter one. We've got a little autumn scene. We've got the little tanuki kids. We've got the snowman. We've got the uh, tanuki shop sign. And, oh, I forgot what her name is. I had her in my village and him too. Very cute. Okay, not sure what I'm gonna do with those stickers. And also they gave me this as well. I think this was just like a extra little freebie. What's this, like a little towel? It's got like a little uh, new year, new year offering, I think. It's like a little tiny little towel, that's cute. And it's got, um, oh, it's got a little octopus, like him. And uh, oh, this has got a little white wolf. Is that Kabuki? Oh, Kabuki's there too. I like Kabuki. Um, here we go, little Animal Crossing. I feel like this just be wiping a baby's face. <laughs> a bit too big for me, just clean up. Um, okay, well, thank you very much for the Family Mart staff who gave me a little freebie. I obviously saw that I was some loony fan, so I uh, appreciated that. Okay, let's move this back in. Oh, I managed to clear this under, under 20 minutes. That's the first. Um, well, I hope you enjoyed that. <laughs> I hope it gives you some ideas of what to find in uh, convenience stores when you come here. Uh, the Animal Crossing stuff might be gone already, but um, you can get some nice nice treats there, nice sweets, nice cup noodles. Um, yeah, definitely check out the Danish. That's quite nice if you can find one of those. Uh, so that's enough for me. If there's anything else you want me to try, I know the food videos are a bit hit and miss on here, so um, it's just a... Uh, crime of opportunity I thought I'd go for it um, then please let me know in the comments what you want me to do next um, I'm thinking about doing <laughs> Japanese fast food at some point because of course you've got your McDonald's KFC Burger King all that but um, we've they've obviously got some some Japanese burger restaurants too like Moss Burger and so on uh, so I could do that or Gyudon as well like the beef bowls so let me know in the comments what you're interested in. Uh, like this video, that would help me a lot. Uh, share the video too, share this channel, subscribe, everything like that. I'd appreciate it a lot. So thank you very much for watching. Take care, have a nice uh, dinner, um, nice dessert, and see you again soon. Okay, bye.